1932, the American people elected Franklin Delano Roosevelt, FDR, as their president. FDR, a Democrat, won by a large margin over Hoover. The Democrats also won the majority in Congress. After taking office, FDR and his advisors created a series of programs called the New Deal to help overcome the Great Depression. The plan had three main goals, helping those in need, boosting the economy, and making financial reforms. In reaction to the New Deal vision, Congress approved multiple laws that increased the government's involvement in the economy and the lives of the people. In order to deal with the banking crisis, President Franklin D. Roosevelt announced a bank holiday, which involved temporarily shutting down banks to prevent additional failures. Congress later passed the Emergency Banking Relief Act, which gave the Treasury Department the power to examine and shut down struggling banks. Banks that were in good health were permitted to reopen, while those experiencing difficulties were kept closed. This action has reinstated the trust of the general public in the banking system. Furthermore, the Glass-Steagall Act was responsible for the creation of the Federal Deposit Insurance Corporation, FDIC, which ensured the safety of individuals deposited funds in banks. Congress also approved the Federal Securities Act, which mandates that companies must reveal details about their stock offerings. The Securities and Exchange Commission, SEC, was established at a later time to oversee the stock market and ensure fairness in its operations. In order to inform the public and gather support for the New Deal, FDR communicated directly with the American people through radio broadcasts known as Fireside Chats. During these conversations, he clarified the initiatives of the New Deal and sought public support. These broadcasts were very important in restoring the nation's confidence during these difficult times. The New Deal, implemented by Roosevelt, provided substantial assistance to farmers and other workers. Farmers were given money for reducing the amount of crops they produced through the Agricultural Adjustment Act, AAA. As a result, farm product prices rose and farmers' earnings increased. The Tennessee Valley Authority, TVA, was very important in the Tennessee Valley. It created jobs, built dams, and controlled floods. The New Deal included different programs that provided jobs and money to help people in need. The Civilian Conservation Corps, CCC, involved young men in building roads, creating parks, and taking part in conservation projects. The NERA was a law that created rules for industries to follow and set up the NRA to stop wages from being reduced, prices from dropping, and people from losing their jobs. The NERA also established the Public Works Administration, PWA which provided funds to states for construction employment opportunities. Furthermore, the Civil Works Administration, CWA, generated additional employment opportunities by prioritizing the construction of schools and roads, and also ensuring that many teachers receive salaries. The Homeowners Loan Corporation, HOLC, provided loans to homeowners who were struggling to make their mortgage payments and were at risk of losing their homes. To help people right away, the Federal Emergency Relief Administration, FERA, gave direct aid to those who needed it. President Roosevelt's New Deal provided significant aid to farmers and other workers amidst the challenging times of the Great Depression. Farmers were given financial assistance through the Agricultural Adjustment Act, AAA, in exchange for reducing their crop production. This contributed to the rise in prices of agricultural products and led to an increase in farmers' income. The Tennessee Valley Authority, TVA, was very important in the Tennessee Valley. It created jobs, built dams, and handled flood control. The New Deal included different programs that aimed to offer employment and financial assistance to those who were in need. The Civilian Conservation Corps, CEC, involved young men in activities such as constructing roads, creating parks, and supporting conservation initiatives. The NERA created rules for industries through the NRA to stop reducing wages, lowering prices, and firing workers. Additionally, the government created the Public Works Administration, PWA, which provided funds to states for construction projects. In addition, the Civil Works Administration, CWA, created more job opportunities by prioritizing the construction of schools and roads, as well as guaranteeing salaries for numerous teachers. The Homeowners Loan Corporation, HOLC, provided loans to homeowners who were struggling to make their mortgage payments, protecting them from losing their homes. The Federal Emergency Relief Administration, FERA, helped people in need by giving them immediate assistance. 
Dr. Francis Townsend introduced a pension plan that became popular among older voters. The plan's goal was to offer monthly payments to senior citizens. Senator Huey Long, hailing from Louisiana, was previously in favor of the New Deal. He put forth the Share Our Wealth program as part of his bid for the presidency. Unfortunately, he was killed in 1935.